Hi everybody, welcome to another video. So today we're looking at the NVE. So this is effectively a, a DV1 copy or clone, whatever you want to call it. So what do you get in the box? You get the gun, which you go, we'll go into, uh, there's no spraying in this video by the way, so uh, we'll do a, a pattern spray out I think, but no, um, you know, like comparing it, I'll do that in another uh, video. So you get a little box of toys, you get a pot, which is the standard generic pot that you get with most of these uh, these fake guns. It's the same thread as the uh, the GTI Pro Lite, the Techna GTI Pro Lite. So you get a 21 mil span, sorry, 22 mil span, which we can use. You get a little brush thing. Uh, and just a, a few other little bits and bobs. You get a little spanner, which we'll go into in a second, and you get a little torque screw um, key, and just a little uh, adapter for your uh, spray stuff. So let's put that over there. Right, so what's it like compared to the original? Well, the first thing you notice when you get hold of this is that it's quite, it feels a lot heavier. Uh, I did put them on the scales, the original, which is this one, this is stripped down just to show you the differences, but the original's 473 grams, which is 16.7 ounces, and this one is 17.5 ounces, so 495 grams. So it's about 20, 20 odd grams more, but it feels like a lot, lot more anyway. Uh, it's not particularly overly heavily, heavy, but it does feel uh, quite heavy. It's not as high, heavy as a, a SATA, for example. So let's have a look at uh, the different bits and what's interchangeable and what isn't. So the cap that comes with it doesn't say anything. Uh, on the DV1, you can get a C1 or a C2 cap. This is the C1 cap here, the original. And this is the fake cap. Hopefully you can see there that the, the fake cap is more or less the same as the C1 De Vilbis cap, which is this one here. Um, it's slightly different in that the gap between the two holes here in the in the um, air horns is, is slightly slightly different, and also the air holes in the CV1 cap, sorry C1 cap, uh, are slightly smaller than in the fake cap. Uh, now, if you get the C2 cap you'll see, or hopefully you'll see, that the air holes are in a slightly different position than the C2 cap, but they're also bigger, and they're bigger than the, the uh, copy cap. So the copy cap is effectively somewhere between the two. Uh, they're not interchangeable, the threads are different. So if you try and screw the copy cap onto the original, it doesn't want to know. It goes on for the first thread and then gets stuck, and vice versa as well. Uh, the tips, we'll have a look at the tips. I'll pull the uh, lever in for those that are worried that I'm not pulling the needle out. Uh, I'll put that on there, but it doesn't actually, it didn't want to go on there. Uh, so we take the tip out and have a look at the tip. Now I have, I have taken this apart once before so that I know what I'm talking about effectively, to the extent that I know what I'm talking about anyway. But you've got the fake one here or copy one there, and the original De Vilbis there. So they both have 12 holes. They both look more or less the same. Sorry, the camera tries to focus on your face. They both look more or less the same. And they are interchangeable in that the threads are the same and they screw into the body the same. Uh, I say they are interchangeable, and that's with a caveat. And the caveat is that the needles are different. So I wouldn't buy a fake one just to get the tip or whatever um we take the needle out of this one and i'll show you the difference in the needle there's a slight difference in the length of the needle the i can't remember which way it is actually but the fake one is this one uh it's slightly shorter than the real one, which is this one. But it's also a different diameter. Uh, you probably can't see, but it's a different diameter 
the fake one uh, actually has a step in diameter, whereas the, sorry, the fake one doesn't have a step in the diameter, whereas the original does have a step in the diameter. Uh, so the original is thinner at the front than this. So the needles aren't interchangeable at all. Um, the guns. Now, the, one of the main things with the guns, the, the, uh, the levers are actually... Uh, levers the control knobs are actually interchangeable uh, as far as I can remember anyway let's try that one on there um, no they're not the threads are different yeah the threads are different so the actual knobs aren't uh, although this knob here for the uh, control of the the fan size uh, is the same if I remember rightly uh, but the, the biggest difference with these is the way they're made now the I've got this light. Let's see if I can get this light down here. Maybe to shine there. That's better. So you see the original. Uh, sorry, the copy here. Uh, it's effectively made like uh, a GTI Pro Light fake, uh, which isn't the same as the way the uh, the new DV1 is made. The new DV1 is made like that oh that's better made like that and it has a uh still has a gasket but the gasket it's physically screwed on you can see those two screws hanging down and if you look through there there's the two screw holes so that physically screws to the body uh and then you've just got a small cover cap which goes over there which this the fake one has got as well uh, but they're not interchangeable those two parts uh, so this part of the body is quite different. So the, the technology they've used to make this, obviously it looks like a DV1, but a lot of it is the same as the body of the GTI Pro Lite fake or copy. So it, it's not a true DV1 in the way it's made anyway. Um, a lot of the other things, like this gasket, for example, this gasket here, is actually the same gasket as the one on the uh, GTI uh, uh, Pro Lite copy. Uh, not the same as the DV1, which is a, a, a different gasket. Um, what else is different? The way this is done here, uh, let's just see if we can undo this. And you can see that these they, they've copied this uh, principle here for the way the um, fan adjuster is made and goes into the body. I haven't taken them out to see if the threads are the same. I don't think they're going to be interchangeable because there's too many differences. So you see here, that's the original, that's the fake. They have copied it more or less um, to a T, um, which is an English phrase of saying, meaning it's, it's the same or looks the same. Um, but it, it's, as with a lot of these fakes, they tend to make it look more or less the same, but it's actually a bit different when you, uh, when you look at it. Um, lever is slightly different on the original than the, uh, copy one as well. Um, yeah, generally, you know, it's, uh, it looks a, a reasonable gun, but, uh, it, it's not. If people are thinking it's a, a complete copy, it's not. So we're just going to do a little spray out and then we'll wrap the video up, guys. Okay, guys, so we're going to do a quick spray out. Now, I'm setting this at about 1.4 bar. Uh, and the reason for doing that is because I've just got thinners in there because I don't want to clean out two guns, basically. But I've just got thinners in there. So we're setting it at about 1.4 bar and it will give you an idea of how it sprays. You might get a slightly bigger fan when you put the pressure up, but because the material is so thin, if I put it up to two bar, it will just split. The fan will just split. So we've got this about 1.4 bar. And that's the sort of, now I'm doing it quickly because it's thinners and it will uh, disappear pretty quickly. So I'll get the original on, we get that to the same, about 1.5, 1.4, yep, just under. You can see it's starting to separate, so if I just bring it down slightly. So 
so it's more or less the same pattern the pattern's slightly bigger on the uh, original and that's probably it's going to be something to do with the air holes but it's not a, a dissimilar pattern don't worry about the fact that there's not much in the not so much in the middle and that's purely because as i say the pressure if you bring the pressure down it should get just as wet which it does it gets just as wet in the middle um, as it does at the top and bottom okay guys hope you enjoyed the video as always cheers bye bye